kids are like gaggy. Hi, hey, we're Derek and Jenna. We started our homesteading journey in 2011 with five small children, a garden, and a few chicks. Since then, we've added three more kids and a whole lot of animals. We're currently renting 37 acres in the Blue Ridge Mountains where we raise grass-fed beef, grass-fed dairy, pastured poultry and pork, free-range eggs, and a large garden. We also have a couple pet goats, several barn cats, and a beagle. We are working on moving from growing just our own food to selling locally. We homeschool our children and are a full-time family with hopes and goals of farming for a living. We would love to welcome you all to follow our family on our journey. Hey. Hey, y'all. I'm driving. He's driving. Yeah. We, uh, we forgot our regular camera, so I'm using my phone. So, um, anyway, we are going somewhere exciting or getting something exciting. Borrowing something Borrowing exciting. Borrowing something exciting. Yes. We are, have been thinking about breeding our goats for a while because um, the baby is, well, she's not a baby anymore. She's old enough to breed. And of course, mama's had a couple babies before, so we were like wanting to breed them. And um, the other day, I decided to put some feelers out on Facebook. And a friend of mine had a buck, and I didn't even know she had goats. So she offered to let us come get him his little Nigerian dwarf buck. And um, she offered for us to come get him and keep him for a few weeks so we can breed our goats and I let's see was it like I think it was Thursday was it Thursday or Friday I don't, I don't know Thursday <laughs> that I figured it out yeah and so we planned to go get him today which is Sunday and somebody's pulling right out in front of us nice um, we planned to go get him today on Sunday well of course yesterday Rosemary the younger one the younger goat came in heat so I was like uh, hopefully she stays in heat because goats can you know be in heat for 12 hours or they could be in heat for 48 hours it just depends on the goat so we were um, we were hoping and this morning she's definitely still in heat she's easy to tell because she runs around going, bah, bah, bah. <laughs> and her little tail wags 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 um, and coco mama I don't know when she comes in because she doesn't show signs it's just different animals are different so hopefully she'll come right in and with these goats red and they they cycle every 21 days so we'll know in three weeks if she doesn't come back and eat, then she can. And we're really excited. We're going to have little babies. It'll be probably the beginning of June, I think, is when they'll be due. So, if all goes as planned. If all goes as planned. It'll but, be expected. Yes. Yeah, goats are usually pretty pretty easy to breed. So, we're really, really excited for baby goats. Derek's more excited than he's letting on. Yeah. The kids are excited. Yeah. The kids are way more excited, and Jenna's way more excited than I am. He's excited. When he gets little baby goats, he holds up and cuddles them. Oh, there you go. Oh, we got two. <laughs> well, that yeah, don't let him jump down. Out. She needs to get him caught. Okay. So, you want, let's get this. Yeah. Reach in there and get the rope off, Jack. Okay. Hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. Do you want to come home with me, too? All right. You can get your hand in there. Move this way. Get down. Yep. Put the leash on him. Put the leash on this guy. You're ready to go. You want to come too, don't you? Right. So we got Bob. I forgot to ask his name. His name is Bob. Yes. Um, and he stinks so bad. No, boy, no sooner than we put him in the van in the crate. And climbed the doors. He broke the grate and the crate apart and climbed out. So he's just chilling out in the back of the van now with the kids. She said he rides loose in her gut. So I, he's, yeah. yeah, he's a good, he's nice. She said he will walk in your house if he's near the house, but we don't, he won't be in front of the house. So it's all good. <laughs> so the kids are like gaggy. They're like, oh, he stinks. He's gross. And Hopi is riding up here. I don't know if you guys can see her since I have a phone. She was back in her seat, which is the next seat back, but she was having no part of riding anywhere near that. Okay. She was like, no. So Jacob and Hope have switched car seats. Yeah. He but loaded anyway. right into the crate really yeah, easily. I was like, did. this is going to be a battle. She but... said he's easy to deal with. So. Yeah, and he really is. He definitely is a bug. He smells terrible. It's quite pungent. Pungent. But, all right, and my and Rosemary's still in heat. So hopefully Coco Mama will either be in or come in and we'll have us some goat babies on the way. <clears throat> We're home. We're home. We made it home. With Bob. With Bob. Stinky, stinky Bob. Bob. <laughs> he's loose in the back of my van. He's happy. Hey, Bob. Oh, he's, he's peed all over everything. He's totally chill, but at least. Hey, good thing we had that plastic down. Oh, Lord, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I smell him. 
pretty rough. Hey, Bob. Come on out, Bob. Come on, Bob. Come on. We promise you'll be happy about this. Come on up. Come on. Come on, Bob. Come on, Bob. Like, I don't want to make him. I'd rather him just yeah. decide this is what he wants to do. He's like, but there's so many people in here. I want to stay with oh, the children. Let's not pee again. Oh. Come on, dude. Mm. Third time. <laughs> At least we have that plastic, hopefully. Yeah, we're gonna get drag this plastic. Jack, as soon as he's out, pull the crate and the plastic out, buddy. Yeah, we'll let the plastic get yes, rained out and wash the stink away. Come on, Bob. Come on. All right, you should be done. Come on. All right, let's go. Come on. No, At least he's not more. spraying all over his face and everything like normal. Yeah. All right, come on. Come on, Bob. Come on, Jack. You might need to. Come on. Come on. All right. Whoop, there, there you go. go. All right, Bob, come on over here. Come here. We got a surprise for you. <laughs> Fence off. Fence off, Kylie. Yeah. Jack, come help get the hey, Jack, corner. Open this, pull this Fence corner up. up. Yep. Hold on, Bob. Pull the corner up. Hang on, guys. Let me come over here. Oh. I want to go on, go. Okay. No, Jakey. You stay in. Do we turn it on? Yeah. Well, not yet. Let's oh, Jack gets it back in. Put in the yeah, same don't turn it on yet. Okay. He smells. He's like, oh, I smell goats. Are they in the house? All right. Go ahead. No, they're over here. Yeah, yeah, don't touch the fence, guys. Oh, he's like, a training. Hey, Joker. Both her and Coco Mama were wagging their tails around. I see that. Y'all back up. Stay back. Come over here. We're going to let Bob meet. Oh, yeah. He's, I don't think he's too big for them. All right, y'all. Sit back. Hi, Spencer. They could. She's not running away. All right, y'all. Go on, Dooley. All right. I say you guys go on in the house. Well, Rosemary's the one who's been acting like she was in, but... Oh, she's gonna headbutt him now. Guys. She almost stood. Yep. Look at her. She's in. He's battling her. Thumbs up. <laughs> Mommy, Alright, y'all go in the house. Car. It's cold and rainy. He's fighting. Yep. Car. And Rosemary is fighting. Oh, there's Bob. Alright, go on. Go in the house. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> All right, I think we're going to have success. You smell that? <laughs> smells like blue goat. Right okay. outside the house. Fence is on, so I'm trying not to get animal cookies. You want one? Come get one, Bob. Here, Bob. I don't think he doesn't know what an animal cookie is. Okay, we'll just play. Don't get on the fence, goofy goat. not interested in animal cookies is he as soon as we got here he was like I mean there was no waiting it was like oh ladies hello ladies and as far as we can tell he um, bred both of them already so we knew that Rosemary is definitely in heat we weren't sure about Coco and she actually started um, had her tail was kind of flagging so we we're like well maybe she is and then immediately that he he went to her first so we were like 
So we will wait three weeks and hopefully they won't come back in. And that means that they're bred and they'll be due at the end of May. And we're stoked. Right, Kylie? Mm -hmm. Baby goats. I'm really excited. It's funny how much him and uh, Bob and Rosemary look alike. I know, they do look a lot alike. I know when I saw this picture, I was like, I hope they're not related. They came from the same county. But <laughs> I doubt it. I don't think they are. No. <laughs> but, no. Because I think Coco's had two babies, two different kittens, just one baby each kidding. And if I remember correctly, she's had a doe each time. So, hey, I don't have any more. Hey. Yeah, I'd be careful touching them. You're going to have stinky hands. Nah. Derek still smells like a butt a little bit. We went grocery shopping and I was like... We had to pick him up and load him into the van. Or into <laughs> his... Video. You'll see it that. was in the crate, but he didn't stay in the crate but for <laughs> about cool. 35 seconds. He was really good. He just, did, you know, he stood up and lay down, stood up and lay down back there. But he definitely smelled. The van still kind of... We've let it air out. It stinks a little bit. We bought groceries and I was like, I don't really want to load him in the back of the van because it might permeate my flour. <laughs> But now I'm glad he's very good natured because sometimes you get butts that are really mean and nasty and so which I made sure he was sweet before we got him. She said he was really sweet, so he's very chill. He yeah, he's and he's small. I was worried looking for a buck. I didn't want anything that was gonna be too big for them because they're very small goats, so he's nice and small. He sticks that tongue out in there. Yeah, that's hilarious. Boy goats. Boy goats are gross. If you know, you know. If you've ever been around boy goats, they can be pretty yucky, but, and they smell bad. But, well, they smell like goats. Some people like the smell. Others, not as much. But. I don't mind the smell. I just don't want to wear the strong. smell. Yeah, you don't want to smell like a goat. I don't want yeah. you to smell like a buck. Aw. Sniffing noses. All right, well, I think that we have had success, at least it appears initially to be successful so i'm really happy <laughs> very happy with that i went from hey my goats are probably be coming in heat soon we should try to get a buck too the buck's here and they're bred within just like three days it worked out really yeah. really quick yeah he did. Oh, he did. i know that's what i said he's not sure what to think about the cats they were out here walking around and he was like I was like, don't hit up my cats. <laughs> yeah. Don't there were plenty cats. of dogs where he was. Yeah. Look at your kitty kitties. <clears throat> There's two kitty kitties. Two kitty kitties. I love kitty kitties. There were three kitty kitties, but I don't know where the other one went. She's oh, wandered off somewhere. He's on the porch. He or she. Which this, is it? this is Sally. Okay, so the pebble's on the porch. He's on the porch. Yes. He's He's hanging out. They like to hang out. They think they're house cats and they hang out at the front door and we're like, live in the barn, go. <laughs> they like, they just like us. So we come out and pet them. These goats think I have more animal crackers. I don't have any more for you today. I'm surprised he wouldn't want one. I think he's more interested. I don't think he can smell an animal cracker ever then. He's like, they smell like goat ladies. <laughs> goat ladies. And they smell good. These are some nice horns you got there. Yeah, he's a he's a handsome he's a handsome man. buck. <laughs> All right, girls and boy, well, y'all behave. Are you done? You've had all the animal crackers you can stand. Oh, hairball. <laughs> we need to get them some more hay. Their hay's wet, but yeah, they'll. Uh... Hey, Bob. Hey, Bob. I'm gonna head my camera. <laughs> they seem to be getting along good. We were worried yeah. that he would just nag the life out of them, but yeah, I was a little concerned. We'll watch him, and then after if he's you know pushy with them or aggressive or just too playful and they're too you know he's just being rough on them we'll try we'll have to separate him but i don't think i don't think it'll be a problem i think he'll be fine yeah he's very chill we need smell-o-vision on this camera yeah we do yeah cat's like you stink Vince didn't get him yet 
They're funny how they stick their tongue out. They are. <laughs> He's like, ladies, you smell my pheromones. <laughs> I smell his pheromones. <laughs> Oh, it's getting ready to start raining again. All right. You're not going to be in the video. Say goodbye. Go ahead. Okay. All right. Well, <laughs> that's our excitement for the day. We're excited for the day. And then hopefully we'll be having babies in a few months. So thanks for watching and we hope you enjoyed it. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Also hit the bell button for notifications so that you will be notified whenever we upload a video and like this video to tell YouTube that you are enjoying what you see on here and we appreciate you. We'll catch you on the next one.